Good morning. Uh, this morning I am going to be doing the old archives. It is part three in the catacomb. So last time I did get, uh, or compared to last video, I did get a few things here. Um, well, I don't know if I had the wind... Yeah, I think I did have the wind bracers. Um, but the, I love the blurry effect. 20% chance to miss. It's in the Kanath Challenges. As well as this ring is in the Kanath Challenges. Um, I'll just go around showing you the rest of the gear real quick. This is a new piece, spare hand. Um, so right now I get at the top plus one bonus to my AC, making it 26, 66 percent miss chance. Without it, it goes to 25. I get a 65, so one more percent miss chance. But the main reason I got it was for the open lock and disable device six. I did not have an open lock item before. Um, so 23. Okay. Uh, I have the troubleshooter set, so that gives plus 3 to open lock, and that's right. They do not stack. I learned that this life. Did not know that. Also, the plus 3 disable device in the troubleshooters does not stack, but the insight bonus, I don't have an insight bonus, so that gives me a bonus to all my saves, which is nice. Um, disable device 6, but if you're looking at the disable device, it only went up 2. Well, that's because I have a plus 4 there, so um, just keeping that on because of the resistance to um, Charisma. I was just using that because I think it gave me a modifier. Yeah, it gave me a modifier for UMD. Uh, this is a pretty nice weapon. I like it. And then the spider cult mask. Which I still have not done the um, ritual on it. Which I will do that. And I'm going to do it on the spider cult mask because that's something I know I'm going to always hang on to because of the additional bonus to all skills and the save against poison plus four. Um, okay, and enhancements went. I don't know if I showed this last time, but I had the one uh, racial point from purchasing the Ravenloft pack, the pre-order. So I put it in fort. Here's a uh, intel to t attack. And uh, here's intel to damage. So right now, know the angles isn't doing anything for me because I don't have any tactical feats that I'm using. Um, so pretty much here at this point, if you didn't after part two, like I said before, you gotta always come up the stairs, go in here, um, talk to um, the council, and then you get the next quest, which apparently I did that last time. So next quest entrance. Part 3, Old Archives. Is right here. I'm going to be doing this on Reaper 1. Um, I am going to call the hire, even though uh, he'll do a little bit here with the bats and things. I'm hoping.
So there's a couple collectibles. I think there's three of them. There's quite a few breakables, some hidden doors. I think there's four hidden doors. We'll find out. Um, a couple traps. One cannot be disabled. Uh, I'm just gonna go get everything, so I'm gonna clear on the bottom here. Plague Reaper. He came. So I'll just leave it there for now. This room is a blood trap. Many bodies and bones lie scattered about, torn and gnawed by sharp teeth. Nothing peaceful here. Alright, so pretty much you start here. Um, you gotta walk down this way. You hear thumps and groans among the shells of the archives. The undead have overrun this place. Wait a minute, I think I guess one around. Go this way. No, I was right. looking for all breakables. They're kind of hard to see in this quest. Because they like to put them like right in these tight little spots so it's hard to target them and see them. here. Um, those guys don't come out right away if you follow him right away. So he comes to here, the librarian, and uh, opens this up for you. myself that way. Oh. Yeah. So hitting breakables in here um, spawns the rats. Let's switch here. There's a trap box and I want to say this one's a fire trap. You can avoid it if you don't have a trapper. Um, when you pick this up, it goes off, so basically what you do is you pick it up and quickly back up, and you avoid it. Here's a first collectible.
gotta love bats. So this in here is a shrine room. Here is I'm just gonna go uh, downstairs and clear all downstairs first. Seemed like I was hitting them, but I don't know something funky was kind of going on there. Interesting. Huh. Well, we will uh, leave him, I guess. So I just dropped down and it took me to here. And you can get back up, there's ladders throughout the uh, library. This room is a dead end other than the ladders. So, in my opinion, uh, this quest is not worth getting all the breakables by any means. Alright, so another dead end on bottom. So all of the bottom is complete. Actually, I can go back up in this room where we left off. Ladder here. That's where that stuck bat is. Or was. Looks like the hire killed it. Ooh. So, 14 jump, I made it without feather fall on. Seems slightly askew. I do see the hidden. Um, we'll come back to that one in a minute. So 34 breakables. Collectible. So this here is the second um, book. A faint voice Not trapped. And 
First book, third book are trapped. Ooh, miss that breakable. It's pretty easy to miss those breakables. Alright, so in here there is a trap. The trap in here it does not uh, it does not have a trap box. So you gotta be careful. It's a one time trap. sure opening it activates it. And that was odd. Cave bat spawn. So there you go. It takes a second. It's in the whole room. It looks like it's some sort of acid. And done. So you just open it like I did. Don't, don't loot. Just as soon as you open it, back up. Get out of the room. Uh, we are almost done. Oh, three hidden doors. That's right, because uh, Librarian opens the first one for you. That is right here. Sorry about that. Let's get that soul of ice. Get him, Clanky. This is kind of why I like ranged tunes. Um, whether it be spellcasters or uh, ranged. A lot of lost souls here. Okay, so we got conquest. Uh, I believe that's the only trap bonus you get. Oh, we did get ransack as well. So here's the last collectible. Champion bat could be kind of nasty. Okay, so here's the last hidden, which uh, you don't need a search in this quest. You just need to hot bar the search. I failed to mention that. So you don't have to have a trapper or someone that's put points in it to do it. Um, they make it so you can complete the quest, even if you don't put points in search. So if you could see, there it looks like there's a trap on the wall, or two of them actually, if you look on that wall, which there is. There's a trap box here. This one's pretty hard to avoid. Um, I have done it. Oh, there's three. There's one in the back wall. I have done it before. Um, but it pretty much save this one for last, just in case you don't, you know... Um, don't have a trapper. Also, it's the last one on your way, typically. I mean, if you have multiple people in your group and you can split up, then, hey, more power to you. Because you can climb the ladders on the bottom to get up here quicker. So, 264 Reaper XP, nice. Fifteen minutes exact. Not too bad. 
Um, so the next one, I have to go back up to the chambers and advance the next chain. Um, so yeah, that right there was the old archives. It says right there that it's a uh, duality. Alright, thanks for watching. Hope you join me in the next one.